Hi, I'm Stephanie Wilson Coleman, known as the Empowerment Doctor. And today, in this hiking chronicle, I wanted to talk about finding your confidence. Um, as you all know, I always tell you to keep a brag list, and sometimes people ask, well, how do I do that? So in finding your confidence, there's some strategies I want you to try. So one is think of three of the toughest things that you have ever done in your life. You were successful coming through those crises. So I want you to write those down. And whenever you lack confidence, I want you to reflect on those tough times and the strategies that you use to get through them because those same strategies will help you in other, in other areas. Then ask yourself, what are the most significant achieve, achievements? So what are my most significant achievements? Hmm, we usually say. Some of us try to think of those quickly and we don't come up with anything, but I want you to take some time to think about your life. So sometimes they could be things like you taught yourself how to properly care for yourself. You actually can look at things that gave you more confidence. So what are they? But take some time to think about that. You don't have to rush through this exercise. Then understand your mistakes. Understanding your mistakes is an aspect of finding self-confidence. When you examine the past and you write down your mistakes, now you thoroughly understand the errors that you made in the past. And I want you to write down what would you have done differently However, be careful with that too because that situation had its own issues in it, its own problems. And when we think about it now, sometimes we don't always remember that. But I want you to write down the mistakes that you now understand. If you need to, find a role model. Find someone that you believe has all of the great confidence in the world and try to model yourself after them. Um, make sure that that person is available to you. Maybe you could use that person as a coach to help you get through some things. Coaches always help. Someone to just lend a listening ear always helps because sometimes we just don't have enough information in order to solve the problem in the manner that in which it needs to be solved. So I want you to have a great day. I want you to write all these down. And I want you to put them on a list and put them in your pocket or your purse or on your mirror where you can see them every day so that you can remind yourself that you actually are very important. Yes, you are. And that you can do great things and bold things. But sometimes we need to remind ourselves of that. So you have a great day. I'm Stephanie Wilson Coleman, the Empowerment Doctor. And as I always say, dream big.